Hey everyone, welcome to a new vlog. So today, well actually, I'm just now editing the video that you're about to see and I realized the first clip I filmed must have gotten deleted or corrupted or something. I don't know what happened to it, but I'm pretty sure whatever I said in it, I think I just said that I came across this video on YouTube and it's to make this Among Us plush DIY out of just a fuzzy sock. So they went to the dollar store, got some fuzzy socks and also got some like stuffed animal stuffing and they made these super cute little DIY plushies. And I should shout out whoever made this video. It was like Macaroon. I have never heard of her before, but she has like one and a half million subscribers. So obviously people watch her and she seems to just have cool DIY videos. And this was one of the ones she did. And as soon as I saw this, it looked pretty easy. I've actually been wanting to make a little Among Us plushie because I wanted to make one customizable to the character that I play in Among Us. And I saw this, it looked easy. And so I immediately was like, okay, I have to try this. So I drove to the dollar store so I could get some fuzzy socks for cheap and then uh, cut them up and make a little Among Us dude or gal. I don't know, they don't have genders. So yeah, I think that's all I wanted to introduce the video with. I just saw this video and got really excited about making this and had to do it like right then. So I basically got up and went to the store. So yeah, that's it. Okay, on to the next clip. All right, this is awful lighting. Oh gosh, is that? That doesn't help at all, does it? Well, oh, I guess I can take this off now I'm in the car. But I ended up getting some socks. Okay, so at first I went there and I thought, darn it, they only have like these striped socks and that's not gonna work. But then I found out that they have like a, just a solid colored sock in the middle. Most of these packs do. I found pink, which is my Among Us player color, and then white to use for the like face thing, just like my face now. <laughs> and then I'm just, I use fuzzy socks all the time. Now I have a bunch. My feet are always cold. So I'll use those and then I'll use the other two as crafts. Uh, but I do need some stuffing, so I'm gonna run over to Michael's real quick, which is luckily very close by. I feel like this, per this is a person backing out right in front of me and I'm pretty sure they're just staring at me this whole time while I'm vlogging. So I'm just gonna be awkward and like stare other places or something, but they probably just think I'm talking to myself. Okay, let's go. Hi everyone, welcome to pumpkin carving with TJ and Zoe. So I am doing like the simplest basic cat face. PJ is doing an Among Attempting. Us character because we have a problem. Attempting an Among Us character. So that one on the left, uh, yeah, I think that's super cute. I think it looks totally doable. So are we ever gonna do part two of the every flavored bean challenge? No. We do have more beans, but God, they're so bad. What, you wanna do a part two? Not particularly, I will say. But, I don't know, we gotta go through the rest of the beans. We can give them to people. Who's gonna accept like a half open pack of bamboozle beans? Now, if my calculations are correct, this should pop out. Okay, maybe not quite yet. <laughs> okay, we are done with our pumpkins. Here is mine. It's a little kitty cat. PJs in Among Us Dude. Okay, so now we have candles. We're gonna put them inside. Okay, wait, we need to turn off the lights. Oh, yeah. That's the most exciting part. <laughs> well, yours looks so good. Does it actually? Yeah. Cute. There's the kitty cat, the Among Us Dude crewmate. <laughs> Cute, I think they turned out well. Yeah. All right, good morning, everyone. It is the next day. Even though I'm still wearing the same sweatshirt I was wearing last night, don't come for me. And today, one of my goals is to make that sock plushy crewmate 
thing <laughs> and I want to do it so badly but I also know that I need to get work done so I want to get my work done first and then reward myself by getting to make the plushie so let's see if we can do this I don't have well I do have work I I feel like every night I stress about all the work I need to do and I'm not doing and then I think okay it's okay you know I'm gonna be motivated to do this tomorrow and then I get up the next day and I sit down at my computer and then I just stare at it and don't do anything. Working from home is definitely more of a struggle than I thought it would be but I'm also extremely extremely thankful that I can work from home so I better take advantage of it and actually get some work done. All right so I am saying this to the vlog so that maybe it'll motivate me. Um, I'm going to try to work and then in a few hours or whatever later I will update you on what I got done so that then I can make the Among Us plushie. Will that work? I don't know. Let's find out. I'll talk to you guys in a few hours. Okay everyone, the time has come. I have lost all motivation and I'm gonna make this plushie now. Also I just remembered to shoot. Oh no. I said I was gonna tell you guys what I did. I read a paper, sent some emails, I worked some on a protocol thing. I uh, did some Google Calendar stuff that took way too long. I feel like I didn't get very many like definitive things done, but I definitely was working, I swear. <laughs> anyway, uh, okay, so. So I watched this video once of how to do this and I'm not gonna watch it again. I'm just gonna try to remember what I saw the first time I watched it. And we're kind of just gonna YOLO this and see how it goes. If you want to actually know how to do this, because this is not at all a tutorial, do not follow anything I do, um, I will link the video down below. First thing they said was put the sock down flat like this and then draw out the little legs. I think I'm supposed to turn the sock inside out first. Wow, we almost started off bad there, everyone. Okay, now I need to draw the little legs. How do I do this? I feel like I need to watch the video again. I think I got it. This. Does that look good? Maybe. I have to sew it. I don't know how to sew. Uh, I just kind of make it up every time I need to sew something and it usually kind of works. So. Okay, for the sake of not um, running down the power on my video and you guys watching me do this, I'm going to attempt to sew this and then I'm going to cut it out and then I'll be back. Okay. Okay, welcome back. So I have my little dude here with two little legs and I cut a tiny little hole right here and I want to turn it inside out. I got the legs. Okay, wait, that worked. Okay, now I need to fill it with uh, stuffing. I'm making sure to get it down into the legs. I think that's good. Cute. Okay, now I need to make the little uh, face thing, face helmet, something. Okay, I cut off some of the white sock and then made a little oval with it. And then I'm supposed to put stuffing into here and then kind of sew it, not all the way, but part of the way to make like an oval that sticks out. So now I need to sew this to the face and then add the little backpack. So I also um, just basically took the rest of the sock. This is only the heel of the sock, so then this was the top of the sock. And it has this little heart thing on it, but I'm just gonna put that on the inside um, so that you don't see it. And I'm going to make the little backpack by sewing together the two open sides, um, filling it with stuffing, making it inside out, and then sewing that to the back of the crewmate. And then I'll show you when I'm done. Okay, I have brought you back because uh, we are about to enter the most YOLOing section of this craft. So, I finished the little crewmate dude. Here's what they look like. Uh, that's like, it's a, you know, it's a little lopsided, just, I know. Okay, so there's a little face and legs and then backpack. It seems fairly well made for my mediocre sewing skills. So I'm pretty happy with how that turned out. But now 
I need to make the hat. And unfortunately, when I started playing Among Us, I chose what is perhaps one of the most complicated hats to make. Here is what the hat looks like. So uh, that's what I'm trying to make. You notice how many colors it is? That's kind of the problem I'm running into here. And I kind of want it to all be soft because I want this whole thing to be soft. I don't want to make it out of construction paper or something. Basically, I cut out this little hat thing, which I will fill with, um, what the fuck is this called? Stuffing stuff. And that can then fit on the head. So I've cut out three of the different colors. It's not gonna look exactly like how it looks like in the game, but I'm not going for exact here. I'm just going for mediocre or something. So what I'm thinking, so I kind of have this here. I'll be gluing it around the hat better than that. And then I cut out this little bit for the bottom um, so that it kind of looks like what I just showed you. Anyway, glue here, we'll see if it works. But another issue I ran into is the only glue I own is uh, I have a tiny little bit of super glue. I don't have a hot glue gun. I don't have regular Elmer's glue. So I think I'm gonna try to super glue it on. And this is where things might go bad. Oh wait, that's cute. This works. This, this is totally gonna work, I think. Okay, okay, let's try it. I'm just gonna put super glue all along here. One layer done. Here's the picture and here's what I made. Again, it's not really exact, but I think it you kind of get the point. And then yeah, I think I'm just gonna safety pin it on for now because I'm too scared to pin it for real. Look, here's some safety pins. Here is the final reveal of my Among Us character. You can totally see the stuffing in the hat. Oh well, okay. It was a lot of fun and I kind of want to make another one. <laughs> Here's a bit of a closer look too, just so you can kind of see what it looks like. Um, I know there's the safety pins that just don't look at that part, but but it's very squishy and soft and uh, I'm excited to have it around on my desk or something. And the backpack's a little big, but that's okay. Let me know if you guys make this, that would be super fun. Also, let me know what color do you play in Among Us. All right, thank you guys so much for watching, bye.